Okay, bro, now you're starting to piss me off. Ten! Fight the tick! Yuck! Nice. Cough! To get beaten like that by a slowpoke is wild, man. Like I said, they up these bitches in this game, man. They up them! Not bad, Larry. What's up, guys? This is Mike from Race Break Gaming, and we don't have our first badge yet. Oh, well, let's play Pokemon Lunatic Crystal! Well, even though we cleared the boss at Sprout Tower, apparently, um, Wagner is still not at the gym. Oof. In the case, Professor Oak, or, or sorry, Elm, <laughs> Told us his assistant's waiting for us here at the Pokemon Center. How's it going, dude? Mike, long time no see. Professor Elm asked me to find you. He has another favor to ask. Would you take the Pokemon egg? Why? Hmm. Uh, Alright. <laughs> I can't scramble it, can I? No, you cannot. We discovered that a Pokemon will not hatch until it grows in the egg. It also has to be with other active Pokemon to hatch. You're the only person that we can rely on. Please call Professor Elm when that egg hatches. Uh, I. Thanks. Hmm. I'm the only guy they can rely on? Is there no other new trainers starting out from New Barktown that can carry out this fucking egg? <sighs> whatever. In any case, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty much going to be spoiling it now. The Pokemon... That hatches from this egg is Togepi. It should be fucking obvious. So it's it's not really a shocker or a surprise because we already know at this point. But yeah, unfortunately the gym is still closed. So you're gonna have to fuck off now, says this guy. Uh, yes, wait. Yeah, 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 yeah. It is nice out. Okay, okay. stop talking. Fuck. Like, that's what I'm talking about. They they constantly keep talking random shit. Like, bro, I don't <laughs> hear about how how nice the day is. Yeah, it's it, 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 it's purdy, okay? But, bro, come on. Damn. And in the case, back on Route 36 here, and... What the fuck is this? Is that some kind of tree? Huh. It's, it's jiggling to the rhythm. Shake that ass. Shake that ass. Uh, no. Nah. Huh. Well, we can't get past that thing, whatever the fuck it is, so. Oh, well, I guess we'll have to ignore it for now. In any case, the ruins of Alf. Hmm. I remember this place. Mystery Stone Panel Chamber. Now, back in Gold and Silver, there wasn't much of anything here we could do. Even when I did solve the puzzles in the Ruins of Alf back in Gold and Silver, the Gold and Silver LPs, it ain't do shit here. I wonder if there'll be a difference here. In Crystal, recently strange cryptic patterns have appeared. It's odd, they weren't here a while ago. You should take a look at the walls. Hmm. Alright, let's take a look at it. Pokemon that hit on the seafloor. Eyes on its back scanned the area. Take a look at it. The fuck is this? Hmm. An ancient puzzle of Pokemopolis or some shit? <laughs> well, in any case, we actually need to solve this little puzzle here in order to unlock something. Maybe. Hmm. Secret treasure? Maybe. Who knows? Well, we're going to find out today because I'm going to solve this for you guys. Yeah, I'm solving it for you. No need to thank me. Cause I was going to do it anyway. All right, now then. Let's see get this piece. Hmm. Wait a minute. This looks awfully familiar. Hmm. Could it be? Well, it's only one way to find out. Eh. I knew it. It's a Kabuto. Huh. Stone Kabuto. Hmm, I guess the parts go here, maybe? Hmm, I hope I did it right. Did... 
Did that help? Hmm, I wonder. Uh, uh, oh! What the fuck was that? Where'd that door come from? Hey, dude! Ah, here's another hole. It's big enough to go through. Yeah, apparently you need to use an escape rope after you solve the puzzle. Come back in and this weird-ass door opens. Huh. What the fuck is all this? Ooh, I knew it was secret treasure! Okay. But yeah, for some odd reason, in gold and silver, whenever, even if you solve the puzzle, it don't mean shit. But in crystal, when you solve it, you get some shit out of the deal. I guess they didn't think to put something extra in here. Oh! Ow! What the fuck is all this? It looks like ancient language. Like Braille. <laughs> oh, God. Don't even get me started on that on that shit back from um, Fire Red and Leaf Green. What the hell? Huh. Music here is all weird and shit. Hey, dude. This is a big room, but there's nothing here. There's nothing here? Hmm. The music is kind of mystical sounding. Pyramids, huh? Hmm. Is there literally nothing here, even after solving that puzzle? Huh. Weird. So I guess the only thing that was new here was that room that had the treasure in it. Oh, well, it's still treasure, so... <laughs> nice little side adventure. Okay, now let's move on with our lives again. <laughs> hey, dude. You have some good Pokemon there, dude. It must be from training you gave them around Violet City. As a souvenir of Violet City, take this. It increases the power of grass-type moves. All right, we get the Miracle Seed. No, it has nothing to do with my... <clears throat> In the case... Your experiences in Violet City should be useful for your journey. Yeah, but I still have no badge. Mm, that's too bad. <laughs> that's too bad. Get it? Get it? Never mind. Whatever. In any case. Um, but yeah, as you can see, all my Pokemon are at level 15. So that means I'm at the level cap, bitches. Um, as far as the Pokemon on this roots here. Luckily, um... Luckily, I have the, um, oh, bruh, really? Sorry about that, viewers. <laughs> my alarm went off. I actually have the gold, silver, and crystal battle theme as my as my morning alarm clock. I know, weird, isn't it? That's how much I love the Johto games. <laughs> but yeah, as far as the Pokemon on this route, not much of really anything has changed here since OG gold, silver, and crystal. The only exception here is is Marie, which you can find here around level 13. So there you go. We got another ferret after the shit I had to deal with with the one back in Sprout Tower. Oh hell no! Get it out of here! Get it out of here! Yeah fuck yeah fuck this guy! Get get it out of here! Fuck! Wait, oh! Oh, yeah, that's right, I be, I be Elder Lee, so that means I broke the level cap. Woohoo! Nice. Okay, now we can move on with life. What's I doing? Oh, get out the f out of my face! Damn. Back to the pound, bitch. There you go. Huh, you're strong. You're strong! <laughs> Bro, you kicked my ass! Now I gotta go to the fucking Pokemon Center! Wow. Just rude! Uh, nah, no, nah, no. Nah. But yeah, he put up a good fight. As far as, but yeah, outside of Marie, there's not really much of anything that really is great here on this route. I wish they could have put something new here. Something, I don't know, different? Better? Better Pokemon on the route? I don't know. It, maybe that's just me. Maybe I'm the one going crazy, but I would think you can put at least something else here. Bulbasaur? <laughs> nah, nah. Maybe. Hmm. 
take note that there, since we can potentially get all 251 Pokemon, um, we can definitely somehow, some way, get the um the Kanto starters. Hey, dude, how would you like to have this tasty, nutritious Slowpoke tail? I got a bargain for you, brah. For you right now, just one million Poke dollars. One million Poke dollars? You want this? Oh, um, can I bargain? I thought kids were loaded these days. Really, nigga? Y'all have no money? First of all, you're offering a slowpoke tail to a young trainer for like one million polka dollars. First of all, who the hell sells a slowpoke tail? That is like, that's in, well, I can't say inhumane. That's in who Pokemon? You're literally selling a Pokemon's tail for, for cash. What? Secondly, on top of that, I don't know. This some, this some creeper shit right here. He's just talking to to train or random trainers. Hey, you want to buy this tail? He's he's like a creeper in a fucking um. I don't know. Are slowpoke tails considered drugs in, 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 in Pokemon Gold, Silver, and Crystal? Because that's how it seems to be, um, you know... I don't know, they don't exactly say it like that, but it kind of sounds like it is. Like, is is the slowpoke tails, um, like, coke? Or some shit in, 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 in the Pokemon games? For one thing, this dude is selling slowpoke tails... At one million poker dollars a piece, nobody can afford that shit. And even with a max money code, you can't afford it either, because you'd only get up to like I think nine hundred. Let's see, nine nine hundred thousand nine hundred ninety nine um poker dollars. So there you go. So you so even still, you you be very shy of getting that you would only need like one more book a dollar in order to purchase that slow hotel but even then it's like a what the fuck why kind of thing so you know i wouldn't bother with that ha <laughs> 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 ha bitch <laughs> Pico sick, ha! there you go you see that would have been Faulkner's pidgeotto if i had fought it right now thunder shocked Barbecued. Nice. He has more. And then there's more. Bruh. Okay, now I'm gonna have to go for broke now, cause we're taking forever. I wanna hurry up and get to the cave. Yes, we have a dungeon coming up. First things first, get faint attack, which is really cool. It's a 60 power dark type move that will not miss unless the opponent is in the air or underground. Then it will miss. Oh, yeah, that's right. Nocturne Spark Ghost Type and, and, and Lunatic Crystal. I forgot. Bruh, really? Ow! I'm kind of shocked. I'm kind of shocked I survived that attack. <laughs> You're attacking me with a, with a hoot hoot? <laughs> Bruh, really? The fact that random trainers are giving me this much trouble is insane it's insane in the membrane it's bullshit uh, get the fuck out of my way damn <sighs> unbelievable maybe you should be the uh, the violet city gym leader that dude almost obliterated my entire team you see, we're already seeing the difference. I mean, fuck, viewers. We're already seeing the difference already. The fact that Elder Lee is literally a boss fight in Sprout Tower, he was literally just a slightly higher leveled um, monk in, in Sprout Tower back in OG Gold 7 Crystal. He was literally trash. Now he's, the, he's like, he's in the big leagues and shit. Good on you, old man. <sighs> this dude, man, he should have been vo <sighs> Wow, okay. That being said, though, let's head through our first dungeon in the game. Union Cave. I'm not counting Dark Cave, because we didn't have to go through that. 
So there you go. Now, as far as Union Cave, we actually have some pretty sexy ass Pokemon up in this bitch. So basically, you guys remember back in, in OG Gold, Silver, and Crystal. Now, back then, it would be really difficult to catch Pokemon like Diglett, for example, because you'd have to wait until post game getting it in. Well, I'm not going to spoil it, but you'd have to wait till post game. However, and Pokemon Lunatic Crystal, you can catch um, Diglets here inside of Union Cave. So if you want a Diglet early on in the game, yeah, you can get one without hacking it into the game. So there you go. You can find Diglets here around level 15, 5% chance. So there you go. But yeah, watch out for the hiker trainers in this cave. A lot of them have some higher level onyxes and shit compared to back in um. OG, Gold, Silver, and Crystal. Back in the OG, these, the, these Hiker Trainers weren't that much of an issue. I mean, just spam Water Gun or Razor Leaf or whatever, because you have those options at this point. But, um, yeah, it would have been, it would have been easy money back in the day. But now, it's like, <laughs> sorry, bitch, but you're not going to have it that easy. Not with me. Alright, confusion gets noise. Thank you for not self-destructing in my face. Huh? No, I, I didn't mean that kind of self-destruct. Hold it in for a later time. <laughs> but this isn't no nut November. No, no, no. Try try not to blow your load all over opponents in this cave. Like, literally, you hiker trainers are a piece of fucking work, man. Like, literally, if I can avoid these hiker trainers, I have no qualms. I have no fucking qualms. But luckily for us, the hiker trainers in this game and Gold, Silver, and Crystal aren't nearly as bad as the ones in, um, in Red, Blue, and Yellow. Ah, here's the Mudslap TM. Yeah, well, obviously, you, you would normally be getting that from Valkner and stuff like that. But, well, Valkner is... We don't fight him first in this game. Like we were back in the OG. So, yeah, shit's different now! So, there you go. That being said, though, now, here in the lower sections of the cave, we still get the Swift TM. So, that, that really hasn't changed here. Um... We got Onyx as well as Zubat. Diglett and Machop. So, yeah, if you want Machop, you can get it early, too. Because normally you can't get Machop until a little bit later on in the game. Luckily for you, you'd be able to get it in a trade not that far into the near future in, at the third gym town. But they changed shit around in that perspective, too. <laughs> so if you want a Machop, you might want to get it now. Because you already know who you're going to be fighting not that long into the future. Yeah. Moo! And you will get KO'd by that Moo. So, there you go. So, yeah. You, you'll you probably want to have some kind of fighting Pokemon before you hop into that battle. Machop is the first one you'll be able to get here. So, I highly recommend that you get Machop now. Get it now. Don't wait and get it later. Because you will regret getting it later. Trust me on this. You will regret getting it later. <laughs> it's, it's not fun! That battle... Oh! That battle is literally not fun. So, yeah. Highly recommend it. Okay, bro. Now you're starting to piss me off. Ted! Fight the tick! Yuck! Nice. Cough! To get beaten like that by a slowpoke is wild, man. Like I said, they up these bitches in this game, man. They up them. Woo. Not bad, Larry. My poor Pokemon. <laughs> Every Friday, you can hear Pokemon roars from deep inside the cave. Yeah, you gotta go deep in there to get what you want. <laughs> right, fellas? <laughs> no, 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 no. But yeah, you probably you probably would want to go a little bit deeper. 
Once you go deeper, the prize will be even more awaiting. It would just be, you know, just, yeah. The deeper you go, the better the payoff. Hint, hint. That being said, no, I'm, I'm serious. The deeper you go, the better it'll be. Ah, uh, yeah. You want that, right? I bet you do. That being said, though, if it's light, a cave isn't scary. If it, you're if you're strong, Pokemon aren't scary. If you're a weakling, you're gonna get your ass kicked. And if you get blown up by a fucking Geo dude, you best find a quick way to the, no. You will find a quick way to the Pokemon Center because you'll be automatically transported there. So there you go. What, what, not nah nah nah. What do you mean it doesn't affect Nine Tails? Okay, first off, Nine Tails though. Really? Whoa! Yeah, that's BS. That's BS. Back in the day, this dude had a fucking um Vulpix. Now he has a Nine Tails, and it's higher level than me. Is it part Ghost type? Cause my normal attacks aren't even fucking hitting the bitch. That's crazy. Oh yeah, yeah, that's a problem. Oh well, gonna have to do this the old fashioned way. Goodbye! <laughs> the nice thing is they give Pokemon like Ninetales at this point in the game give a lot of fucking EXP. So in all honesty, it's all good. Let's see, Slam? Eh, nah, nah, slam, slam is kind of meh. So there you go. Flash! <laughs> it's my Pokemon's fire that keeps this cave lit. Cool, thanks for that. It prevents me from having to waste time teaching Flash to one of my Pokemon. In any case, all right, out, out of Union Cave. We'll be going back there a little bit later on for a side quest, though. Don't forget what that, that Poke... Oh, yeah. Forgot to mention, Pokemaniacs in this game, they look a hell of a lot more, um, psych psychopath. No. All Pokemaniacs have, especially the ones in Gen 2 and 3, yeah, they look like literal psychopaths. Like, literally, they look like psychopaths. So, yeah, I know. It, it's creepy. They, the, the, they were already creepy to begin with. Now they're even creepier. Zookeepier. So, um, yeah. The fact that his slowpoke was able to wear my team down like that is, is some, is nightmare fuel. Why did I use Peck? Okay, that was stupid of me. And accidents were made. <laughs> no, 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 wait, wait, sorry, sorry, I, I phrased that wrong. Mistake, whoa! Bitch! Yeah. Th All the trainer battles are like boss fights. This is insane. Right. No, they are literally boss fights. Meaning I need to kick that ass even quicker. Hurry! Double slap that bitch. When you get double slap like that, damn, you best get that pad away. Um, yeah, get rid of bubble. It's completely worthless at this point. No point defeating my opponents with bu wait, rock smash. He he literally learns rock smash leveling up. Oh, that's boss. That's boss. At least we got a fighting type move, so that's cool. I might, I might just want to catch myself a Machop. Because, <laughs> probably not going to have a fighting type in time for you-know-who soon. But, yeah. I recommend that you register Anthony's number here. Unlike the other hiker trainers that we've encountered since Gen 1, and the ones we've already encountered in this in this Union Cave, yeah, Anthony is a good dude. Back in the day, he, he would alert you on Dunspar Swarms in, in, um, in Dark Cave, but he... You know, let you know about another Pokemon swarm in Dark Cave. I think, I think like a, a, a Larvitar swarm, I think, in Lunatic Crystal. And that's some, and Larvitars are rare. Of course, there might be an easier way to get Larvitar in this game. Potentially earlier. 
I'm not gonna spoil what that method is. That, wait, what the hell? Hey, dude! It's unsafe to go in there, so I'm standing guard. Aren't I a good Samaritan? Uh, I don't know how to answer that. What the fuck is Team Rocket? First of all, wasn't Team Rocket disbanded? I pretty, I'm pretty sure I kicked Giovanni's ass, and he said, Team Rocket's going forever. I recognize this black uniform anywhere. Granted, the black uniforms are so spunk. They, I love black clothing. Black clothes, that is. I wear black clothes. I don't know why. I, I think I got that from my mom. <laughs> she always, she loves black clothes and stuff like that. I think I got that from her. Look at this. All black. Black hat. Black um uniform. Black shoes. Damn. Intimidating as fuck. Well, Gen 1 Team Rocket, that is. This dude is just, hmm. Could he kick my ass? He pro Well, it is Lunatic Crystal, so he probably could, could kick my ass. Or cook my ass. <laughs> if he wanted to. In any case, we made it to Wazelia Town, but... Why is Team Rocket here? Guess we'll have to find out next time! On Let's Play Pokemon Lunatic Crystal. You guys enjoy it, you know what to do. Hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel for gaming videos from me. And of course, when you subscribe, be sure to hit the bell to notify my newest uploads. Got something to say? Of course you do. Leave a comment, duh. Till next time, dude, dude, that's my phrase break game. I hope your rage breaks. Have a great day, my bitches and bros. Smile you later.